hello, good evening, and welcome to Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Sorry if I look a little bit tired. I've just been walking all day. It's been really hot over here. But that's not going to stop us from going to Lalaport. So Lalaport is a gigantic mall over here that just opened up this year. It's owned by a Japanese company. They opened up many Lala ports around Japan, but this is the first Lala port in Southeast Asia and happens to be here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. So check it out. They have a big garden over here and this big garden has a special theme that's happening right now. So let's see what's happening over here and see how the mall is. Hopefully you get something to eat too. So as always, please hit that like button and subscribe and let's go. area so a lot of restaurants a lot of places uh, I believe there's some bars over there but what we're focused on right now is over here there's a lot of fans over here Liverpool fans because the British Football League just started and uh, we have a big screen over here I hope you guys can see but Liverpool is playing Fulham let me know what is your favorite Premier League team I just want to show you a little bit of British football and here in Malaysia they love British football apparently look at it very crowded so let's go inside of the mall and so check out part of this massive mall, multi-level, got LED lights all around, and check it out. So today they're having a, I don't know if it's like some cosplay festival or some anime festival, it stopped. Most of it like the booth's closed. Let me just show you a little bit around. I might record a whole vlog about this tomorrow. Let me know guys if you're into cosplay or anime. Excuse me. That guy looks cool, some cool characters. So yeah, this is in the Japanese mall. So of course in the Japanese mall, you'd expect some anime, some cosplay people. Okay, so I just have reached the top garden over here. You can see this tall building over here. The world's second tallest building. Here's the KLCC tower over here. And I just wanna show you these little weird, strange little things over here. Oh, they make noise. You hear that? And actually, I'm not supposed to even be here. You're supposed to get tickets, they're free tickets, but they have like these like barriers over here, even bigger barriers. But uh, yeah, I just hopped over the barrier because I see the security wasn't paying attention. So I was just like, let me just hop over the fence. So the rooftop garden has some beautiful views. What do you think guys? Really nice. All right, by the way, guys, I just want to show you like which barrier I just jumped over to get inside of here. It was so funny. Like literally, I, I, per I planned it out in the perfect time when they weren't paying attention. So here's the barrier over there. And I just literally just went over. Oh, well, actually, I just crawled underneath. And yeah. The exit's this way? All right, thank you. Oh, that way, okay. So funny that no one even noticed. Oh, I love it because I didn't want to come back tomorrow and wait for a ticket and all that. So I was like, let me just finish this video today. Look at this. Cool sounds. All right, now we are back in the Lala Port Mall. Guys, playing some piano and cosplay. And then over here, they have an upper food court and then they have a lower food court. I'm not really sure where I'm going to eat at because I just ate maybe like three hours ago. So I'm not really hungry right now. So I'm going to show you a little bit of their food court area. More cosplay characters. Hello. All right, so this is the upper food court area. I think I'm going to go down because I saw a little bit more interesting food choices downstairs. And uh, yeah, you can see it's pretty crowded from uh, everyone going on the upper garden. This is a special event. Let me just show you a little down view of the small. Look how massive it is. As I'm walking downstairs, I just want to show you they have a big Japanese furniture store over here called Natori. Well, yeah, this, this mall in general has a lot of Japanese stores and you can see it just opened up. So a lot of stores are not even quite open right now. Toy World over here, which I don't even know what the store is. Good. Show you a little bit more of the mall. It's a massive mall. 
It has a lot of indoor space and then also has a decent outside space as well, which I showed you in the beginning. So I decided to go in this Japanese store real quick just to show you. It's like a little version of Ikea. Maybe some prices. So you get this clear water bottle for like only 10 RM, which is like around $2, $2.50. I don't know if the security caught on that I'm recording here, but I don't know if they mind or not, but might as well show you guys. Yeah, tea kettle is for like 45 RM, which is like around $10 for a tea kettle. Oh, they got more, they have bigger ones, 2.6 liters for 70, which is about like around $17, I wanna say. There's a guard right there. Walk over way. Cute little cat bed. <laughs> Let's walk a little bit more around the store. What is this pinch hanger? 20 RM, which is about uh, four dollars and fifty cents. Okay, and they have a lot of curtains here. Okay, interesting place. All right, now time to go down. But I just want to show you like one of the biggest stores they have in this mall. Okay, we have reached the bottom area of the food court. There's a lot of different choices. I don't know what to get. Let me show you a little bit of like, this shop has a lot of goods over here. Some bakery goods. A lot of breads. A lot of the cheese bread. All right, cool. But it's nighttime, so they're running out of supplies. Where should we go? I'm not really sure. Piaz Maca. Nutella crisp wrap. Wow, let's see. She's making. She's making the wraps over here. These are some of the wraps she's making. Hi. Hello. Juices. Wow, such a variety of choices. I love Kuala Lumpur and I love Malaysia because like literally everywhere you go, you have so many different food choices. Uh, what do what do I do? All right, let me find some food and I'll let you guys know. Container kebab. That seems really good too. All right, yeah. So I'm not. I'm a little bit indecisive right now. So let me figure out what I want to get and I'll see the next shot. Okay, so I found this place called Memang Miao. And they say they have the number one Nancy Lamak in town. So if you want to go to the number one Nancy Lamak in Kuala Lumpur, apparently this is the place. <laughs> okay, so I found a place to order. So let's see what I get. Well, apparently that was a fail. They said they closed at nine o'clock and it's, it's only like 9.40 right now. So I understand why like all these shops are open, but I guess they're just getting ready to close. I saw Burger King over there. So I think we're going to go to Burger King. We'll go the American way for tonight. Get a burger and get something else. I hope Burger King's still open. Okay, I just made it to Burger King. I just want to show you real quick. They have a big value menu over here. So for only for 10 ringgit, it's uh, about like $2.20. You get a burger, a Coke, and a soft serve ice cream, not bad. Or if you don't want a burger, you get a chicken burger, charter crisp chicken. So let's see what we get today. All right, well, apparently Burger King's close too, which crazy is the mall closes at 10, but they were the last customer at 9.30. Man, sucks. <laughs> oh man, I'm so hungry. What am I gonna do for food? I have no idea. Bye bye Burger King. Oh man. Well, as they say, third time's the charm, so. Well, the mall didn't work out, but I ended up getting this cheesy naan. So it's cheese, garlic with some naan bread. If you don't know what naan bread is, it's a famous Indian type of bread. They made it nice and fresh and dip it. Actually, before I dip it into the hot sauce, let me show you how it is. Ooh, look how cheesy it is. I'll try a bite, this one. So good. If you like pizza, you'll like this. Only thing that's missing is tomato sauce. So cheesy. Kind of reminds me of cheesy bread. If you know what I'm talking about, like in America, we usually have cheesy bread. Same type of taste. I'm gonna dip in some hot sauce. Actually, it's not hot sauce. It's, let me show you what it is exactly. It's Tabasco Sriracha. 
Oh, you know me and I love spicy. Let's try with the spicy sauce. So tasty. So this is about it. I'm gonna end the video right now. So I got this for if you're wondering how much the price was for the cheesy naan. Also it has chicken inside, sorry I didn't mention. Cheesy naan chicken. It was only for 13 ringgit, which here's the price. That being said guys, we're gonna finish this. Love you guys, this is a quick vlog today. And uh, just let me know what you thought about the video. As always, please hit that like button and subscribe and I'll catch you in the next one. And if you wanna see other videos, around Kuala Lumpur, just click somewhere up on the screen. Oh man, so good. Man, all right, all right, see you guys later, peace.